send the the sheep killer to the chickens so he doesn't repeat the process. Yep. So, I don't think I've explained that in any videos yet, but last month he got over in the neighbor's flock and killed a baby sheep. He wasn't like murdering it, but he uh, he took he it down he took and it, down, it hurt. He took it down, he's playing with it and he injured it too much. So uh, now he's just, he's on hardcore probation. Uh, he doesn't really have free range of the 10 acres anymore. And thanks to Stony Ridge Farmer, we saw that he trains his dogs with the uh, sport dog collar, static collars. So we got that. This is the 425X, baby, if you want to kind of show him the oh, yeah. shop collar. Um, it's a really nice collar. It doesn't, hasn't caused him any uh, uh, discomfort yet. We've done a couple training sessions, and uh, he's still not really 100% sure kind of what it is. He seems confused sometimes uh, about the vibration. Have it hardly had to even shock him. Um, the the static buzz seems to be enough to get his attention. He just stepped over it. He's, he's, he's a Rhodesian Ridgeback. He's a pretty smart dog. So we haven't used it on our. He yet. just likes to chase. Yeah, he's just got crazy predator drive, man. When he locks onto something, he's a sight sight hound. So it's just impossible almost to get him off. That's what we're working towards. So we're gonna introduce him to our chickens and ducks. Come on, Thimba. Uh, and just kind of see how he does and let you guys see the process of this. So, come here, Thimba. I should probably introduce you first, yeah. So, see Come on. He's all tangled. This Thimba. He's a little tangled up. Like I said, he's a Rhodesian Ridgeback. Oh. Uh, he's a little over two years old. He's uh, very well trained. He is a indoor, outdoor. He's an indoor dog, but he's kind of, we're trying to teach him to be a protector of the house and the property <laughs> and but we don't want him harming our chickens he chases the cats not much we can do about that we chases some of the cats some of the cats are smart enough not to run if, he, if you don't run <laughs> he's not going to chase you that's kind of how it is um, so we are working on that vigilantly and we'll see how he does so let's see how he does with the chicks he's oh, our angel uh, i should probably let you know some of the commands I'm saying. We we don't speak another language, but just because we wanted him to only listen to us, we decided to train him in uh, Czechoslovakian. So he knows like half a dozen or so, maybe a little more commands, but they're in Czech. So if you hear me kind of saying those, just bear with me, and uh, maybe we'll do another video in the future on that and, and um, some of his commands and why we chose to do that. Uh, so come on, see any good boy. He already got a right, look the at first him. sacrifice. <laughs> the first sacrifice. He got a look at him earlier, so now this is the first time, like, really close up. I'm oh, I probably should have explained, too. Yeah, this is the collar here. It's a wireless collar up to 400 yards, which yeah. is pretty amazing out here. On 10 acres, you need that. I'm worried they're going to run out because... Yeah, they're not going to run out. That's all right. Okay, well, I'm going to close it just in case. Okay. Better safe than sorry for me. Because he will take advantage. Be nice. Be nice. It. It's a live animal, baby. Hey, see Edney. See Edney. See Edney. See Edney. You got the collar too, baby. Oh, you got it. It's okay. Good boy, okay. Thumb. Be nice. Good boy. Good boy. It's just a little bird. It's nice. Good boy. See? <laughs> you don't eat these. Okay? That's a good boy, Thimba. Just, just sniff them. Nice and gentle. Easy. See? Doesn't show too much interest. I mean, he, he was definitely super interested. I'm sure the ducks will be a little bit different of a story. Oh, well, if he got in there with... If he got in there with them and they all started going crazy, then... He, 
It would be yeah. a bit of a different story. Yeah, like I said, he doesn't. He's not going to like slaughter them and go no. nuts. He uh, just, it just it would be he would play too rough with them and injure them, just not knowing his own strength. Uh, he's he's gonna he'll learn as he obviously gets older. But. It's like we have this, but you don't actually hunt. <laughs> nice. Good boy, Thimbo. Good boy. Good boy. That's a good boy. See, you, know, you have to use the collar. But see, when the collar's on, it's like he kind of knows he's in working mode. Hey, Siedney. Siedney. Zostan. Good boy. <laughs> Always with the attitude yawns. Like, oh, my God. <laughs> Easy. Hey, it's okay. Nice, them. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah, the duck. Our yellow duck is turning white. So this is Darkwing. Darkwing. Oh, getting the grit. Hey, go back over there. Go back over there. Shoot, shoot. Okay. That's <laughs> very curious. Okay, let me back away. Oh, this is lunch, huh? Sydney. Sydney. Zulstan. I know. Look at this thing. Easy, Thimba. Nice. Thimba. Good okay. boy. Hey. Easy, Thimba. Easy. Hey, Siedney. 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 Come here. <laughs> Is he's, he's, not so, he's not so sure about this one. Come here, Thimba. <laughs> he's drooling, though. That's not a good sign. Come here. Yeah. Come in here. Hey. Come in here. It's a good. It's, good. it's okay. Siedney. It's okay, Baba. Good boy. Siedney. Just be nice. Siedney. Hey. Yeah, you heard me. He's drawing all over my hands. Oh. Uh oh. Okay. So Thimba likes ducks more than he chickens. Likes ducks more than chickens. To so, eat wise. Something we're learning. Come here. Come on. It's, it's okay. okay. It's okay, boy. It's alright. Good boy. It's Oh my gosh! You gotta get that tail wagon, man. You're not in trouble. It's okay, Bubba. Be a nice boy. Come on, good boy. See Be Siedney? nice. Hey, see any? It's okay. Good boy. Look at it. the... See? It's okay. Yeah, smell it. See? Now, if you eat okay. one of mama's ducks, she's gonna be really mad. Okay? <laughs> Alright. I really See? will. I'll be very upset. Yeah. Nice. Good boy. Good boy. Nice. Good boy. Right. Just so good. <laughs> All right, so there you pretty much have it. So how we kind of got this guy here adjusted to the chicks, uh, showed a little interest, and then just obviously they weren't running and uh, just kind of lost his curiosity. He's always looked up and wanted to visit the cage but we wanted to wait till we got the shot collar and got him kind of sort of used to it uh, before we introduced him to the chicks so that's kind of how I've seen people do it that's how obviously we, we tr we're gonna try it out make sure we're not gonna lose any to this guy uh, we're not too worried about the blue okay, healer, so. which we probably should be. He just he ha he doesn't show near. He's he's faster too. <laughs> he's yeah, he's faster, but he uh, he's he scared of a lot of stuff, faster. and he's just he would he'd catch it before you. Yeah, uh, I we'll see though. We're gonna see how it goes, uh, and obviously we will do an update on the video as the chickens get older, as they get in their static run, as he kind of gets more adjusted to them, and we'll let you know if we uh, have. If he, if he has a good relationship with the chickens and ducks, or if he's just going to always want to chase them and play with them. So we'll, we'll see how the training goes with the shot collar and keep everyone updated here throughout the next couple of months.